How are you doing? Well, I'm doing just fine. I lied. I'm dying inside. Hey guys, it's Mira. Today is going to be more of a serious thing because certain events have happened um, today and this week. And it, it's hard to explain, but my great-grandmother on April 9th, not April 8th of 2016, she passed away that morning. And I couldn't say anything because she was part of my, my family and it's really hard to talk about this, but this is an update to why I couldn't do anything this week, why I haven't been responding to any of you guys. It, it's a serious issue and I just wanted to put it out there. It's really difficult to deal with a lost family member. My great grandmother, she was very, very sweet, though I haven't gotten to meet her for the second time. We would talk a lot, but we couldn't because she always, she lived all the way down in Florida and I'm in the middle states. So I could never like actually see her because I don't have money to and I couldn't do anything. I wish I could have talked to her at least one more time before that happened because she was so nice to everyone. just wanted to speak with her one last time because she's still my family though I haven't known her for very long. It's very hard to get through this and I know I'm repeating myself, I'm sorry, but she was a very, very important person that I wish I could have gotten to know more about her. I'm sorry, this is a very emotional time for me. This is almost as bad as um, my mom when, um, when I was around the age of, like, I was like five, six, seven, and my mom got thyroid cancer. I didn't know what cancer was at the time, but I didn't realize that I could have probably lost her if she didn't get rid of her thyroid. I could have lost a more important family member that has taken care of me every day since I was born. And I I wish that this was easier to do, but it's really not. So, just to make it short and sweet, um, I'm trying to do my best to get over it, and and everything. So. Yeah, and I was hoping that 
um, that I would get a chance to talk about someone who watches my videos who also has cancer and was diagnosed in January. Her name is Kawhi X Misa May X, and not to get too personal, but she has a type of cancer. And I was talking to her the other night, and when she told me that, I was very depressed because I know it's like to go through cancer, but not through like the person who has it, but through the person that um has seen someone have it. But the effect that it has on people with cancer is, um, it is very emotional. You have that feeling that you might gonna lose someone that you love very, very, very much. Either that or you don't even know them, but for someone, they are very, very important to someone. And it makes them want to, like, do whatever they can for them. through a person's perspective of knowing someone who is going through cancer I am going to say this now if you, any of you know someone who has cancer please support them no matter what it's a very tough time to get through and just to get through it is amazing but if, it, if you don't show them the love you have now you don't know when you're gonna show that try to get into least fights try to be more active with the person <laughs> but in general <laughs> cancer is terrible I know I'm getting into really touchy subjects here but I just have to get these out there because people take cancer very lightly and people's relatives very lightly because they don't know what it's actually like to lose someone who's a part of their family, like a few of people out there actually know what it's like to lose someone until they're like out in their um, adult years, like above 21 and everything. But since I'm still very young, it impacts me a lot. So I thought I would just give this video out there to show that I've been through this kind of shit and it's not fun and for the past three days I have been crying and then I started thinking about my mom and how much I actually do love her and every other family member so anyway <clears throat> never start partying live loud and rock out We'll see you guys in the next video, whatever I make. How you doing? Well, I'm doing just fine. I lied, I'm dying.